Hello everyone, welcome back to Infigyan. In this video, we'll be solving another very, very interesting and challenging question from rational equations. x plus 1 over 2x plus 1 whole square plus x plus 1 over 2x plus 3 whole square equal to 3. So let's get started by writing x cannot be equal to negative half. x cannot be negative 3 over 2 also. Denominators cannot be 0. Now we can write this 1 and 3 as 2 minus 1 is 1, 2 plus 1 is 3. So I can write our equation x plus 1 over 2x plus 2 minus 1 whole square plus x plus 1 over 2x plus 2 plus 1 whole square equal to 3. Now we can consider multiplication of 4 both sides. So I will write here times 4, here also times 4, here also times 4. So 4 is 2 square which we will take in the bracket as whole power 2. So I will be writing 2 times x plus 1 4. 2 times x plus 1 minus 1 whole square. Similarly, second term, 4 will come in as 2 times x plus 1 over 2 times x plus 1 plus 1 and then whole square. And right hand side will be 3 times 4, 12. Now we will use substitution. Let's say 2 times x plus 1 equal to a. So our equation will become a over a minus 1 whole square plus a over a plus 1 whole square equal to 12. 2 times x plus 1 equal to a. So I will write equation as a over a minus 1 whole square plus a over a plus 1 whole square equal to 12. Now I will add 2 times the first bracket a over a minus 1 times second bracket a over a plus 1 both sides. So 2 times a over a minus 1 times a over a plus 1. So LHS will give us, if I will consider this is m square, this is n square, then here we have 2 times mn. So we know that m square plus n square plus 2 times mn can be written as m plus n whole square. So I will write a over a minus 1 plus a over a plus 1 whole square as LHS equal to 12 plus 2a square over a plus b times a minus b, a square minus b square, so a square minus 1. Now we have to simplify our LHS. Let me write here a over a minus 1 plus a over a plus 1 whole square equal to 12 plus 2a square over a square minus 1. Now we will take LCM a times a plus 1 plus a times a minus 1 over a minus 1 times a plus 1 and then whole square equal to 12 plus 2a square over a square minus 1. Now we can expand a square plus a plus a square minus a over a square minus 1 whole square equal to 12 plus 2a square over a square minus 1. 
now we will cancel plus and minus a from numerator so we will get 2a square over a square minus 1 whole square as LHS and RHS is 12 plus 2a square over a square minus 1. Take all the terms in LHS. So we can write 2a square over a square minus 1 whole square minus 2a square over a square minus 1 minus 12 equal to 0. Now this is quadratic equation in 2a square over a square minus 1. So better is to consider 2a square over a square minus 1 equal to t. So our equation will be quadratic in t, t square minus t minus 12 equal to 0. Now we can use method of factorization. We can write minus t as minus 4t plus 3t. Then we have minus 12 equal to 0. Now t is common from first two terms. So t minus 4 will be in the bracket. And once we will take 3 common from last two terms, we will get the same bracket t minus 4 again. So factorization will be t plus 3 times t minus 4 equal to 0. So we can conclude from here t will be equal to negative 3 and 4. Now t was our substitution 2a square over a square minus 1. Let me write here 4 and negative 3. This will be equal to 2a square over a square minus 1. So I can write here 2a square over a square minus 1 equal to 4 and 2a square over a square minus 1 equal to negative 3. Or we can write 2a square will be equal to 4a square minus 4. So we can write 4 will be equal to 4a square minus 2a square or we can write 2a square will be equal to 4 or we can write a square will be equal to 2. So a will become plus minus a square root. Now we will solve second equation. Let's cross multiply. 2a square this is equal to minus 3a square plus 3. So we can write here 5a square equal to 3. a square will be equal to 3 over 5. So a will become plus minus a square root 3 over 5. Now this was a. a was our substitution. 2 times x plus 1. So I will write here a equal to plus minus root 2 and plus minus square root 3 over square root 5. Now a was 2 times x plus 1. This will be equal to plus minus root 2 and plus minus root 3 over root 5. Now I can rationalize here root 5 root 5. So we can write plus minus root 2 and plus minus square root 15 over 5. Now we will divide both sides by 2. So we will get x plus 1. This will be equal to plus minus root 2 over 2 and plus minus square root 15 over 10. Now we have to subtract 1 from both sides. So x will be equal to minus 1 plus minus the square root 2 over 2 and minus 1 plus minus the square root 15 over 10. Now we can take LCM 
we will get our final answer x will be equal to minus 2 plus minus root 2 over 2 and minus 10 plus minus root 15 over 10. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.